Technology is changing the way we live, work, and interact with the world. So Crown Castle is working hard to make sure communities like yours have the right mix of towers, small cells, and fiber to keep you connected. Understandably, many ask, what are small cells? Like their name implies, small cells are small. They use low power antennas, sometimes called nodes, that are often attached to existing structures like streetlights and utility poles. Fiber connected small cell networks have become the preferred way of expanding wireless coverage and network capacity. With thousands of small cell nodes already deployed around the country, there's a good chance you've walked by them before and never even noticed. This is one of nearly 50 nodes we've been deploying in this city since 2014. Every community is different. That's why we work closely with cities on the design, in this case, the paint color and light standard. It matches the other poles in the area. So let's take a closer look. First, notice the larger base. Inside, there are multiple radios serving our wireless carrier customer. Our small cells are designed so that multiple wireless carriers can use them, reducing unnecessary infrastructure and maximizing benefits for residents. Next, at the top of the pole, there's a 4G Omni antenna. This means it provides 360 degrees of coverage. This antenna accommodates 12 ports for coaxial cables that are hidden inside the pole and attached to the radios. This is all then connected by underground electric cables that power the node, as well as fiber, which means that this small cell can handle massive amounts of data at fast speeds. And this fiber is not just connecting the small cell network, but it also serves the neighboring businesses and organizations. Now, let's take a look at a small cell attached to a utility pole. Every community has different needs. Some want the equipment on the ground, blending with the streetscape. Others want the equipment on the pole. Here, the radios are in this cabinet. It contains one radio serving our wireless carrier customer with room to accommodate two or three more customers. And just like communities, utilities have different needs too. In this case, we use a smart meter, which can be as small as a hockey puck. But what happens when you add 5G to an existing 4G installation? Well, let's take a look at a different utility pole. The 5G equipment is placed directly underneath the 4G LTE antennas. With 5G, the radios are built into the antenna to reduce latency. Fully integrated 5G antennas will not only enable faster speeds, but new technologies and mobile experiences that will make our cities smarter, safer, and more efficient. And there you have it. We hope you learned more about small cells. They're helping keep your community safe, connected, and ready for the future.